Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful with you guys to any of you having a Hyundai day Santa Fe, guys. And if your AC is not working, guys, stay with us. We'll explain a common thing that can cause that. Actually, on many Hyundai Santa Fe's, uh, uh, this is a clutchless AC compressor. And we'll explain what can cause the compressor not to turn on. So stay with us. We're going to cover that today. Also, we have a special video that explains the top five reasons why, guys, okay, why AC compressor does not work. So please check it out and you will uh, learn even more about the system but today we will share something very common especially if you have a higher mileage vehicle now you don't need to remove actually your engine guys okay to do that repair we have it out due to the fact that we'll be making hundreds of videos that can potentially save you thousands of dollars and with the engine being out we can easily guys okay show you where things are located so let's explain okay what can cause that today so this should work on Hyundai Santa Fe generation 2013 all the way to year 2016 guys with a 2.4 GDI engine. Now let me introduce you to the channel quick. Every single car we get at the garage we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. We take them completely apart, we show you how to fix practically anything guys. Why we do all that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. Oh we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. This engine, okay, will be completely taken apart, transmission will show you how to fix almost anything on it another thing if you need to buy any parts or tools guys okay check out the link in the description of the video below and you can see where we get all the tools and parts from for a really good price and quick shipping as well that's where we get all our supplies from so this right here okay this is the engine and uh, before we start let me tell you guys if you have a Hyundai with a 2.4 GDI engine or other cars check our main channel how to repair guys we have helped more than 110 million people guys we have information that can save you time thousands of dollars so let's start on it now so this is guys the engine out of a 2013 Hyundai Santa Fe okay right here 2.4 GDI engine and uh, many of you guys I noticed in the comment section you asked me to recommend a good diagnostic tool this is guys one of the best ones okay right here I'll put the link in the description of the video below please check it out it works on almost any car you can think of guys Hyundai is right here and it can pay itself off in one time use so please check it out if you're on the market for a good uh, good diagnostics tool so with that being said guys this is the AC compressor okay out of a Hyundai Santa Fe it's a clutchless compressor back in the day used to have a clutch and wires that go in the magnet the coil and activates the compressor now you have only one AC compressor valve solenoid that actually activates that compressor that valve guys if it's bad your AC will will not be uh, working due to the fact that the AC will not activate the purpose of that valve is it replaces the clutch due to the fact that first it makes the AC compressor okay when it turns on smoother so your engine is not jerking second it can control the pressure inside so at higher speeds highway speeds it can decrease the pressure or if the ac starts getting cold it can decrease the pressure so actually it makes it even more efficient so your car is not using so much fuel as well to power that ac compressor but if that valve goes bad that's very common guys and we have a special video how to test that valve so uh, let's explain now okay this is the wiring harness you just press here and you disconnect it you have one snap Ring. okay that we're going to remove with snap ring removal tool and okay once we remove it guys okay be careful those can easily fly in your eyes so always put your hand when you remove them perfect now right here guys okay that valve okay uh, sometimes you might need to spray a little bit of penetrating oil but not much not to get in the AC compressor because it can be really really stuck uh, if you get with two screwdrivers or a prying two on each side okay you can okay pull it out okay just like that so you just grab it and you pull it out guys and this is the AC compressor valve that can cause that. Now we have a special video that explains how to test AC compressor valve and find out if it's good or bad. So it will be on the channel how to test AC compressor valve on the Hyundai San uh, Santa Fe guys. And it will teach you how to do that. Hopefully guys the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.